<laughs> Amazing. Yeah, I think they'll stay here. Right, here we are, just um, leaving Junction 38 T-Bait truck stop. We're going to be early. We're going to be very early. It's my seat, <laughs> passenger seat. Jolly good. Let's see if we can get this right, <laughs> but actually opening the door. Looking good. Barrier open. Uh, 
I don't believe it. That could be a Conway Bailey. It is. <laughs> I'm all the way to T-Bay to find the Conway Bailey. Lovely. Excuse the window. <laughs> it's a bit noisy. I think that's one of the um, Conway Bailey's. One of the Murphy Tipper boys, actually. I think I'll go up to that truck stop again um, where I went last time and have some breakfast. Try and get there for about 11 o'clock. Good morning, Dringy here, and I'm just having a 45 in Carn Farm, and um, just bought myself a breakfast roll with a coffee. Lovely, and um, I was quite surprised actually. It's the first place that I've seen that actually sells hand sanitizer, and they got lots. But the problem is, it's four pounds in the tiniest little bottle, which will probably last me about a day. So that works out, it's very expensive when I've got a large one, 600 mil, yeah, 600 mil bottle for, um, no, 500, 500 mil bottle for 11 pounds. Which I thought was quite expensive, but when you work it out, it isn't that bad. Anyway, it's not raining up here, and um, 
I'm going to enjoy my bacon buddy, my, my breakfast roll, and uh, go from there. I'm only 11 miles away from my, my tip. Tringy here, all tipped in Glasgow. And now I'm going to have a cup of coffee, I think. And the paperwork sort out. Because um, still waiting instructions for the uh, return load yet. I'm, uh, let's put it this way, I'm about three hours too early on my delivery. So I've kind of thrown a spanner in the works, I think. No one expected this uh, load to come off until at least six o'clock. <laughs> but um, it's off and I'm empty. And I've got plenty of room here to have a cup of coffee, so that's what I'm going to do. I'm out of everybody's way. Perfect. That's twice I've been for a year now, and that fish and chip shop's been open. <laughs> I should remember that in future.
Hey Lou, Dringy here and uh, we're in for a bit of cooking. I am going to do some pork loins cooked in some Cornish butter. Look at that. Cooked into, into some Cornish butter and uh, so it's going to be pork loins in uh, a mushroom gravy and I'm going to do some rice with it as well. So uh, mushrooms, onion, a bit of garlic, salt and pepper, Bob's your uncle and all the rest of it. And I'm going to do it in my big pan. I've just chopped the onions and they're a bit strong. Oh, <laughs> Jesus. So uh, I think we'll get on with it. Maybe even put a bit of broccoli in as well because I've got some spare. Yeah, why not? Add that to the old sauce. Proper job. I'll put it out in, in the last couple of minutes. Perfect. I like the idea of that. Now Dring is cooking on gas. Quite literally. <laughs> yeah, that's going nice. Just get rid of some of the now that the um, the rice is softening up a bit, I can get rid of some of the clumps. Perfect, Amando. Just give it a bit of a stir around. And that, ladies and gentlemen, is my tea for tonight. Hope you enjoyed it. It's um, lovely pork chops. It tastes delicious. I've just had a taste and I've still got some left for later on. Or, no me, I'll probably eat the lot in a minute. So, uh, goodbye from me and thank you very much for watching.
Right, that's dringy loaded. Got to clean my glasses. It's a bit damp out there today. But um, as you can see, that was a interesting kind of loading.
Right, Dringy here. After that load this morning and that lovely trip down the A68 again, hopefully in better quality um, footage, I'm going to cook some breakfast. I'm at Rotherham, four and a half hours exactly. And then uh, I'm going to cook bacon, egg, no, bacon, mushroom, sausages and beans. That'll be lovely. So uh, here we go, breakfast time. There we are, ladies and gentlemen. There's our lunch. Or yeah, bit of dringy lunch here going on. Hello there, dringy here on a Friday morning. Um, my plan of tipping. Uh, a morsel and then reloading bottles didn't happen. I loaded a load of cement now of rugby. Um, got down as far as uh, Tewkesbury for a nine hour break and then uh, this morning did a changeover and gone back up north. So uh, I shan't be home to Saturday, shouldn't have thought. No, I won't. <laughs> Definitely not. So um, I'm just waiting to tip. I've got your early and uh, they were going to get me in early but um, they couldn't so I'm going to go and give it a go in, in a minute I past 12 and then uh, get that tipped and Northampton tipped and then reload somewhere it's sunny as well it's just quite nice actually I would tell you, it was so nice to meet up with one of the subscribers yesterday in uh, Northampton, Morrison's. Uh, at least we were uh, side by side on the base, so uh, we managed to yap and all the way through the tipping, so uh, that was a pleasure. That was really good. But, um, yeah, just woken up, cup of tea. And then it's down to get myself loaded. Perfect. Oh yeah. That is nice. What a day. Do you know, there's not a cloud in the sky. Not one. I haven't parked in here for many years. In fact, it says no, no overnight parking. Cafe use only, but the cafe's closed. So, uh, I guess that's the way it goes at the moment.
Well that's uh, the end of another week. I haven't got long to go now before I'm back in the yard. And um, the end of another vlog, vlog, whatever you want to call them. Video logs, I guess they call them. Not vlog. <laughs> oh dear. Bloody bugs are in that windscreen. Oh. Well that's it ladies and gentlemen, that's the end of the week, pretty much, I've got about half an hour to roll and uh, the end of another dringy vlog. Um, hope you enjoyed the scenery and a bit of uh, cooking, <laughs> the cooking's quite popular actually, uh, a lot more than I ever thought it would be but um, yeah enjoy that, I'll, I'll do the two again separate, I'll do one main vlog with a um, shortened down cooking and for the people who like to follow it I'll do a full extended normal version like I have done for the last two weeks. Anyway thank you for watching, thank you for subscribing, please uh, give a like, a comment, I do look at them all, I will reply to uh, as much as I can. Um, I'm not bothered about gaining uh, a big audience or anything like that so I'm uh, monetizing or n not interested I do this for pleasure really um, and to give people an insight into the, the world that we live in it's now Saturday half past 11 in the morning I'll be in the yard just after 12 just after 12 and uh, I'll be in by 1 not bad. Give the lorry a wash, drop the trailer, give the lorry a wash, do me paperwork, get me cast stuff out of the cab, quick polish up and gone. And uh, hopefully I'll see you next week. All the best. Bye for now.